The spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance has returned, my lord. It's been killing people in the old ruins. I haven't heard of this spirit. You're sure this isn't the Mongols' doing? You don't know the legend of Lord Yarikawa's final curse? The musician Yamato tells it better than anyone. He's near old Yarikawa now. I'll look for him. Get to the bottom of this. Hey. You're a good horse. <laughs> Sora, come on! Quickly, Sora! Lord Sakai, please join me. 
The tale of Gosaku awaits you. Gosaku? Tell me about him. Gladly, my lord. Two and a half centuries ago, Tsushima was terrorized by the Red Hand Bandits of Akashima. Around this time, a farmer named Gosaku heard the spirit of a dead samurai calling to him. He found the body, still clad in brilliant armor. Overwhelmed by the armor's beauty, Gosaku stole it. Before long, the Red Hand reached Gosaku's home. Knowing the farmers would lose everything if the bandits went unchallenged, Gosaku donned the samurai's armor. The bandits charged. Gosaku's sword arm trembled in fear. He resigned himself to death. But blow after blow glanced off the armor, and Gosaku did not falter. The bewildered bandits staggered back, tripping over their feet. A mysterious sense of calm suffused Gosaku's body and mind. Impressed by Gosaku's bravery, the dead samurai spirit guided his blade. Before long, Gosaku cut down the final bandit, and the Red Hand were never seen again. Years later, when Gosaku died, the farming families locked the armor away for safekeeping. Each family holds a single key to the lock. Now terror stalks our island again. The farmers of Tsushima claim to have seen Gosaku high on a hill looking for a mighty warrior to protect our farms once more. The armor is still locked away. And now the Mongols are hunting for it, raiding farms across the island in search of the keys. Which farmsteads hold the keys? <sighs> Aoi, Iijima, Kuta, Koshimizu, Ohama, and Yagata. If you find the keys, they say the armor is hidden on a hilltop in Akashima. The Mongols will never lay hands on it. Of that, I am certain, my lord. Romeo's here. No sign of any other monks, though. I'll find Kochi and the other monks and return them safely. I promise you. The invaders won't stop our work. Lord Sakai! Norio, where are the monks from your temple? If your blades need work, let me be of use.
Who will face me first? Sora. I knew you'd find me, Sakai. You can go, boy. Straw hats are cowardly traitors. You all deserve death. And samurai are spoiled hypocrites who steal glory from real warriors like me. I'll prove it. Come on, then. your life in a castle. He made you. Then why are you out of breath? Your life in a castle. He made you. Then why are you out of breath? Hey! <laughs> 
fights. Farewell, Ronin. Standing amidst death. Always standing together. Fading memories. Day of my life, my lord. Be careful up there.
going to be all right. I'd given up hope before you came. You're safe now. Stay safe.
of Gosaku, my lord. As a sign of our gratitude, take this key to his armor. I will wear it in defense of the people of Tsushima. Good, Sora. Hey <laughs> okay, Sora. You seem lost in thought. Is everything all right? There's so much to fear right now, my lord. But there are still places of beauty to remind us what truly matters. Even the birds know it. I followed a flock to a place that filled me with peace. I used to write haiku in places like that. There was no better place to center my mind and body before battle. I hope you'll find peace again soon, Lord Sakai.
Halt, Ronin. State your business. Samurai? Lady Sanjo will want to see you. She's in charge of Omugi Cove. Please, come with me. It's important you speak to the lady. I'm telling you, the Mongol Emperor's throne sits on the tallest mountain. I was trying to fix my wagon with pieces from a bamboo stand when I was told a samurai had built it. Is that true, my lord? We use the bamboo to hone our skill with the sword. It takes focused blade to cut through all of the bamboo in one stroke. Please forgive my ignorance. I put everything back where it belonged, even the flag beside it. I appreciate that, but it would have been all right to repair your wagon. I'll make sure the stand sees use. This way, my lord. I hope I have what you're looking for. You have my thanks. I look forward to hearing of your victories. Some recent acquisitions here. Your victories give us hope. Lord Sakai, this is Lady Sanjo. Welcome to Umugi Ko. I see the Mongols haven't found this place. Thankfully, no. There hasn't been bloodshed here for many years. Anyone who draws a weapon answers to my men. Your safety is assured. So long as you abide by that same rule. Now please, tell me how I may help you. I'm looking for a smuggler named Goro. <laughs> Interesting. He is downstairs, having his third... Enjoy your visit with him. Thank you. Come see me again sometime. I think we can help each other. Lord Samurai, please, I have a message for you. What's wrong? A demon is going to kill me if I don't tell you his tale. Don't waste my time. Demons are just legends. Not this one. His name is Kojiro, and he cannot die. Long years ago, Kojiro was a straw hat ronin. So fearsome, deadly, and bloodthirsty, his own brothers turned against him. From dawn until dusk, dozens of straw hats fought Kojiro. He slew them all. Those who escaped that day disowned Kojiro from the straw hat ranks, but never crossed him again. The spirits of death were so astonished by Kojiro, they blessed his armor to grant him a tireless sword arm. He's now more than a man. He's a slayer of legend. When the Straw Hats betrayed our people and joined the Mongols, they welcomed Kojiro back as a brother. Five killers from the Straw Hats have joined Kojiro 
and sworn an oath to kill you. Kojiro wants me to know I'm hunted. I'll be on my guard. No need, my lord. Kojiro will grant you the honor of a duel. But you must earn that privilege by dueling the five straw hats who joined him. It seems I already accepted his challenge without realizing it. And you know they're waiting across the region. And we'll use innocent people to draw you to them. I'll finish this and make sure Kojiro dies, as he should have all those years ago. Be careful. I've never met a man like him before. I'm not even sure he is a man. You must be Goro. Uh, we must all be someone. Who must you be? Lord Sakai. Aye, ah, the samurai are all dead. I'm very much alive. But my patience is dying. Lord Shimura asks that you repay your debt to him. He's alive? Uh, what does he want? To deliver a message to the mainland. Uh, I charged a lot for that trip. Even before the Mongol blockade. You owe my master a debt. This will repay it. Then I have no choice. After Komoda Beach, I thought my debt to Lord Shimura was erased. That's why I was drinking. To celebrate your escape? To mourn the samurai. Those warriors died protecting men like me. Hmm? If that's how you feel, find your courage. Help us avenge them. We need a lot more samurai to do that. Jimura's message. Hmm. This is my home. Come in. Hmm. Getting past that Mongol blockade won't be easy. Do you have Lord Shimura's message? He has it. At his camp on the Akashima coast. Ah. I can work with that. One of my boats is hidden near Fort Mitodake. This map shows where I'll wait on the forest road. Open up, Koro! We're not leaving until you pay us what you owe. Shit. I'll deal with them. Get moving. And I'll leave you to it. See you in Akishima, Lord Sakai. There's no use hiding, Koro. We know you're in there. I didn't call for Ronin. Uh, my lord, what's your business with Goro? Private. We'll... we'll be back.
What's wrong? My daughter's missing. I haven't seen her in days. Could she have run away? She wouldn't do that. Please, find her. My mother was like you. Would stop at nothing to keep me safe. Then you understand. Where did you see her last? At the dojo. I left early. She said she'd catch up, but she never came home. I'll do what I can. Someone there should remember the girl. Who let a dog into the dojo? Kenji, what are you doing here? Lord Sakai! My prayers have been answered. That remains to be seen. What's wrong, Kenji? Uh, I owe money to a bandit, um, Gon the Butcher. Then you should pay him. I will, I will. But uh, he wants to meet me in the middle of nowhere so he can cut my throat. What did you do to deserve that? He paid for a delivery of sake and medicine, and I might have skimmed some to help survive his fleeing Izuhara, and didn't think he'd notice. <laughs> there are better ways to help people, Kenji. My lord, I'm an idiot. And you want me to clean up your mess? Couldn't you just watch from the shadows in case Gon tries anything? If you scare him off, he'll just put a price on my head. Your intentions this time were better than usual. I will help. Thank you, my lord. Where's the money to pay your bandit friend? I brought it, don't worry. What's wrong? You lose something? Yeah. <laughs> 
Over here, quickly. 